Hi, Internet. Welcome to the Grudge Run YouTube channel here with another Rocket Reaction. You know, after many requests, we are finally getting back to status quo, and we are doing early status quo off the first album. We are doing pictures of Matchstick Men. Um, I think this is a cool album. I actually really like the first two status quo albums. Uh, I haven't listened to this in maybe... Maybe like five months or so. Um, so it's been a little bit a uh, little bit of time since I've listened to it. But um, I definitely like it. And so it'll be a fun little refresher. It's very different than what the band became known for. But honestly, I, I like this better than most of their uh, their their most popular era. The, the era that the fans are most into. Um, I dig this. So um, yeah, let's listen along and uh, you know see what commentary springs to mind. I mean, yeah, there's a, a lot of cool stuff right away. I mean, a very Ringo-esque drum beat, um, great vocal melody, great vocal production. Um, it just it has a great sense of atmosphere. I love the wah guitar. Um, and lyrically, you know, this song um, has uh, this sort of debate as to the interpretation of it. Um, some uh, see it as a male frustration with women's sexual liberation. Um which I think is a really fascinating interpretation of it. But, you know, it's it's psychedelic, it's trippy, but it's catchy and fun. I mean, this is just a, a freaking killer tune. Yeah, such a killer hook. That's so freaking great. I love it. Yeah, so that is Pictures of Matchstick Men by Status Quo. Uh, yeah, that's a freaking killer tune. Um, basically, no complaints with it. It's just um, great atmosphere, great production, well-written, well-performed. I mean, like, I, I have zero flaws with this one. It's just, it's great. 
S rank. Great song, and I know that um, to many status quo fans, they're like, what, this is the era of status quo this guy is into? Uh, but, you know, that's... um, What I really think is that, um, based on my limited knowledge of status quo, is that they became a harder-edged rock band, and they started to really focus on the boogie and, um, like, you know, getting you locked into a hard rock riff, and so it, they have that great 70s hard rock sound, but I think the songwriting was stronger in this era. I just think there were better songs. And so, I mean, I love those 70s hard rock bands, but I feel like the difference is, like, these songs from these couple albums are just stronger songs. And so maybe if you had these same songs during that era, um, maybe I would appreciate that the other era more, but... um as it stands, yeah, I guess this is my era of status quo, that my favorite era at least. Um, so yeah, that's my hot take for this video. <laughs> um, but uh, seriously, uh, I think this is a really great song. I uh, hope you guys like it. Uh, let me know what you thought of this in the comments below. Be sure to do the liking, the commenting, the subscribing, all those good things. And uh, yep, have a good one, everyone.